Yo, 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 what's going on everyone? It's TK and here we are with the Town Hall 17 update. It looks kind of crazy that, yeah, we already lost our scenery, but let's put up this building down here and we got the Hero Hall. Now, we're going to come back to the Hero Hall, of course, but I need to upgrade everything that I can. Okay, we have a lot of offers that I'm going to be purchasing and they have just been added to the Supercell store. You can see, obviously, we have all these, you know, things, but the offers are here. Let me go and buy them. Okay, but the offers beautiful. We got the update packs and they are going to be added to our loot. This is going to be kind of crazy. I'm not even going to lie to you. This may just be even more expensive kind of gemming spree than the Town of 15 one, if you guys remember. But we got a lot. But now let's see what else we have. Nothing really. So let's go on and oh, we got to place this building too. Oh, come on. How many buildings do we need to place? Okay, we need to go and upgrade our town hall, but we are going to go with gold because it's not much of the gold anyway. So like we don't want to go with hammer, but goodbye Eagle Artillery. Yes, we are going to say goodbye to him and let's just gem this town hall. Obviously on the levels of the town hall, it has five levels. So we have to go with the gems because they are a lot less gold than using a hammer. And then on the last level, I will use a hammer. Okay, no worries there. So let's go on on to the level three of it. We're gonna go to level four and just keep on gemming and then we can use a hammer on the level five yes yes that's level five let's make sure all right so level five boom here we go let's go come on let's upgrade this one man let's go now one thing is for sure i think we get offers with the town hall 17 right because we should yeah the shop it has two options so let me go and see what offers do we have it was indeed a Town Hall 17 pack. So, yeah, I bought it. Of course, I bought it. But it's going to be a level 2 of this Fire Spitter. And we need those Archer Towers to get leveled up. So, yeah, I'm going to be investing a lot of gold for that. Just one Archer Tower. I wish this offer was higher, guys. I wish this offer was higher. But we need to build. I wish there was, like, two Fire Spitter and, like, a full multi-Archer Tower or something. But it's still decent, all right? It's still fine. So, we are going to have the Ricochet Cannons. They are the same amount. So I would just go with another hammer, I think, just to get that done because they are quite expensive. Getting the hammer, getting over that Fire Spitter. Now, we do have the Supercharges. Don't worry. I'm going to do my absolute best to try to see how many we can go. But let's upgrade this Ricochet Cannon to level 3 and another Ricochet Cannon. We still got our own gold and then we have our runes. So no worries there. Cannons. Now, one thing we can do is to, of course, go with that, you know, multi, you know, ricochet cannons and the multi archer towers, and they are quite cheap actually. So I'm going to, I think, gem the way they are going to be upgrading because it's not much. It's 1,000, yeah, 300. That's easy. Gemming that because we need our books. The books are going to come in handy, guys, okay? So I'm going to keep them. Now, the multi archer towers, we need to build them. So I need to upgrade this altar tower. Let's go, let's go. Let's keep upgrading that one. I think it's, yeah, level 21. So we can just keep on going. And um, yeah, 4 8. Let's go with another. No, 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 not Bukoko. Oh my God, I got nearly scared there. Hold on a second now. We can go with gems and now we can go with that, you know, third multi archer tower. One thing, guys, I'm going to tell you, I'm a bit nervous. You know, I was nervous because I need to get this video out quickly. That is the goal. Let's book this Archer Tower. We are done. And now we can just go ahead and use our runes, right? So how many runes do we have here? We got eight. That's enough for us for now. So Multi Archer Tower, let's go with that gold. And we do have a lot of books. So we are chilling. We do also have a lot of book of everything. So we can use them inside our book of building also. No worries there. Now, I don't really want to pay for walls here. So yeah, it's like, ah, oh, we got a bit of gold left. Yeah. Mm. Can we get here? Yes, that should be fine. Nice. CC always comes in handy, man. Let's go with that level 3 multi archer tower. Book that one as well. And then we can use another rune of gold. I don't know why my scenery is kind of, you know, just bugged out. I think after every update, it's just like that. I probably have to switch it around. So in the middle of video, I'll probably do it. But I have to edit that part out. So books and the runes. Let's see. Now, we do have another runes. Let's use it for the last multi-archer tower to level 3. We're going to use a book on it. And now, the ricochet cannon. One thing we can do is to use another rune, but 4.6 million is quite a lot. So, yeah, I think the gold from the CW Elmedor should be fine. I think that should be fine. Maybe like a few of it if I buy. Ah, it is what it is. It is what it is. Let's just go for it. And now we can go with that. But guys, I'm doing all my best to give you a clean gem to max video. But 
yeah, I think we're not going to be able to do that at the end because we're going to be low on some, you know, runes and kind of resources. You know what I'm saying? Because the updates did have some nice packs, but beforehand it didn't. But no way, these traps are so expensive. Oh, no way. Nah, that's insane. But guys, one thing I'm going to kind of tell you is that I actually was recording on like kind of this video, of course, live, but my mic went a bit bad at the end, you know, and like in the middle ish kind of. So I have to do a redo. I cannot be two different person on the same video. So, you know, I'm doing a redo of this whole thing. Otherwise, it would have been most likely out in YouTube maybe half an hour ago. So, yeah, that's my bad. Sorry for that. But yeah, hopefully it's better than the last one as I didn't speak and it was just a music. But yeah. CC, let's get it done with. We're going to go with most likely a book or a gem. What do you guys think? A book, I think, is fine. Let's go with that book. And we do have the laboratory. I think we do have a lot of elixir runes. We do have five. So we're chilling. And a lot of book of everything. So we should be fine on a lot of elixir upgrades. And also Grand Warden upgrades. Don't forget. But getting that spell factory, the you know laboratory and the barracks with elixir is a beautiful feeling. Getting them done and dusted. Now, we are going to go back to the gold upgrades, I think. But... Heroes, we could do something nice with them. But the superchargers are also crazy. Now, with the troops, I will come back. Don't worry about it. Now, air defenses, 16.8 million. Oh, my God, guys. Supercell really want us to go broke, I think. But we are going to use a lot of our league shop medals right here because we do have a lot of them. And we can get quite a lot of golds outside of it. I wish I had more. I just wish I had more, man, okay? But we have enough for now. One more should be fine to upgrade our air defense. And we can then use another rune of gold to get our later air defenses. But we can only do it once. This um, kind of 6 million is going to be, I think, decent amount for our later superchargers. But not on the first level. They're going to be at around 9 million. So we got the walls to do. But I don't really want to pay for that walls for now. I think I, think I did one or two walls later on in the video. But still. Now... This is where you can also get a lot of gold, which I used, I think, a few times in this video, but I'm not sure. So, yeah, uh, I wish I had that live, like, whole thing, man. But obviously, my mic kind of messed me up. Sorry for that again. So, we are finished with the air defenses. We do have a lot of runes still left to go with the wizard towers, but we're going to end up gemming a few of our gold resources. So, let's go ahead and kind of go with this gold, I think, because it's 2,900, but the other one is 3,000 something, so it's too much for me. Now, we can go with the gold and then go with another wizard tower and see just, like, what can we do with the rest of the money because these are cheap. Like, the super charges are quite cheap than the you know regular upgrades so i'm gonna go with that wizard tower and we do have the books to finish them off unless of course we don't have any more books i'm gonna start gemming those building upgrades so buying this and now we can go with the gemming and look it's beautiful and clean no like i'm doing the best i can do to get this gem to max video clean as hell but still we're gonna be a bit dirty as i said near the end we got 7 million Again, we can use a lot of these golds here. Thankfully, this gold is really good. And now again, we can go with 125 gems and just uh, not a book. Yep, not a book, not a book because it's not that much. Now, the wizard towers, we're going to kind of go ahead and finish them very soon. So don't worry. They're heavy upgrades, just like the air defense. But I don't know. They don't defend like an air defense. So it is what it is. More gold, we're going to go with another supercharge on the Ricochet Cannons. Guys, I'm actually going to fully get upgraded on those supercharges on the major, major defenses. But on the Bomb Towers, Wizard Towers, and Air Defenses, I just don't think I have the ability to do that. It's too much. It's way too much, man. But let's go ahead and buy a rune from our medals and go ahead get this wizard tower upgraded and we are going to go with another book. I think we have a few books left. Yeah, we got three. That's decent. That's decent. We can use something like the bomb towers and also you're going to see the perfect spot to use our last book of everything. Okay, don't go anywhere. I know I'm missing something right now in this gemming spree. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll get there. Now we do have the bomb towers. Quite expensive actually, to be honest. And this is where I believe I'm going with one wall or maybe not. I'm just going with Dubai gold. Yeah, we're going to buy gold and go with another supercharge. This is around 8 million. Going to gem it. It's not too long, so no worries there. Level 2, Fire Splitter, supercharge. Hopefully, that will help me get some defenses in Legends League. Finally, you know? You know what I'm saying? 
Now we do have some extra gold left. We need to get to upgrade those bomb towers and they are quite expensive as I said, but not as expensive as the wizard towers and those air defenses. So 4,200 gems. Let's go with that. We do still have 75,000 gems, which hopefully is going to last us enough. Okay. That's the main goal. Now, this is where I was kind of reminding myself, yeah, the gold is going to be worth it on here to gem it, not twice buying from the store. Sometimes you may need just 11,000 and that's the best way to get that. But still, we do have the ricochet cannons that I really wanted to get supercharged because they are heavy defenses and I can really work well with them. So 12 million, we should be fine on upgrading them. But at first, we're going to do the fire splitter, maxing that out with the gem. And now, moving on to the ricochet cannons, we need a few more gems or a few more of those CWL medals, which I think the CWL medals is just an amazing way to gem to max these updates. You know, obviously, you don't have enough runes, but now you can see how I calculated both of these ricochet cannons to get it done with one gemming of the, you know, purchase. But still, we do have another book, which I'm thinking now what to do. And then the hero hall is right here. Boom. We're done. Perfect upgrade. Now we do have the heroes, which we will come back and max every single one of them. Hopefully that if my, you know, dark elixir allows me. Okay. It's crazy. I don't have that much rune of dark. So yeah, the game didn't allow me to buy that much. You know, of course there was not much updates and um, kind of offers. Now, Ricochet Cannon, one more. Go ahead, maximum. Now we do have one Ricochet Cannon and four, three Multi Archer Towers. But one thing I wanted to do was to go ahead and use my Hammer of Troops on the Minion because it's a Dark Elixir troop. I don't really want to invest Dark Elixir on two troops because we got three or actually four heroes now to upgrade with the Dark Elixir. Healing spell, I'm going to use the book, um, and sorry, the hammer, but uh, one thing I was unsure was the lightning, but the lightning is quite cheaper, so we're going to go with the healing. Now, the spells and everything, we will come back to them, so no worries to that, and then we do have, obviously, um, a few traps and everything, but I'm thinking about heroes. We could go with our warden with the elixir, just for now. We can use the runes for our elixir laboratory upgrade, so let's go ahead with the warden level 73, Keep booking that and we do have a bit left. We could get from the clan castle, I think, because that's where we can get more elixir. Obviously, always. Thank you, clan castle, for always being there for me. We can upgrade the warden to level 74 and then go ahead with one book of heroes. Oh, sorry, the hammer of heroes. I'm going kind of crazy, guys, you know, because it's been a while. I haven't talked this much on an entire video, you know, and quickly, of course, because you guys get then get bored, you know, but if you don't want to hear me, you can kind of mute the audios and go and play a song if you want. But I remember a lot of people wanted to just have me talk through this gemming spree because it just works better for them. So we do have a lot of dark to invest, but I'm going to buy a bit more elixir most likely here because guys, these runes will give me decent, but again, it would be too dirty to try and get kind of the elixir up. You know what I'm saying? 5,000. 400 something but we still do have a few of these elixir which we cannot just upgrade something through that laboratory so i'm gonna go ahead and buy one pack now one thing i wasn't sure is to let's see that wheel medals i wish i would have gotten more like 2k or something you know but i didn't invest anything on any skins recently i just didn't do one cwl i believe it was two months ago or something so we're going to go with that and then we can upgrade the wallbreaker, then the wizard because I love wallbreaker and the wizard. Those two are amazing. So we're going to upgrade them before everything else. 7 million on the elixir. I think this is where I go with one all wall upgrade because we cannot just yet buy a rune. But no, oh no, this is not where. So we wasted 7 million elixir. Yeah, guys, obviously me looking bad at what I wasted is actually reminding me of how much wasted elixir there may have been. But still, it's fine. Now this is where I go with wall. I think yeah. Oh no, not the not the gold. Hold on a second. Nearly the gold. Hold on. We do have that beautiful wall right there. Let's go with another elixir and get everything upgraded in this place. We are gonna go with the baby dragon, I think, first. But one thing I wasn't unsure was the heroes. Like the elixir heroes, I was done with, but the dark elixir, it was like kind of crazy, you know, because I was scared. I was scared. But now we don't have any more runes, but do we do still have a few elixir upgrades? So one thing I'm gonna do is to go back, I think, to my supercharges. But we are gonna buy more elixir from this store and we're gonna actually upgrade another wall 
to get another rune from the metal shop and here is where this metal shop is saving me with those runes okay so going back to that laboratory now is where we can go with that dragon rider upgrade and book it off we are done with those troops we have the new troop which i will still kind of have to upgrade so don't worry there no worries there absolutely we dug 60k gems and guys you might be saying why don't i just gem and gem and gem it's because the heroes guys yes the heroes and the traps are taking too much so we can go ahead with the more loot here and yeah we got the ricochet cannons upgraded except this one so we're gonna go ahead and gem it off we got 6k left i could go with more cwl medals but i'm looking at here and seeing i think the calculation will be decent enough to get me to a certain level of gold so then I can go with more CWL medals because I just don't have runes. Yeah, the superchargers really messed my calculation, guys, obviously. And it's just amazing how they could defend really good. That's why I'm supercharging these few defenses. It's amazing. But yeah, hopefully until here you enjoyed this gemming spree. I know it's kind of crazy investing this much, but anything for you guys, I will obviously do. And hopefully, again, you guys enjoyed it. But we still got time. We still got time to upgrade our heroes and everything. So don't go anywhere. Gemming these stuff and then going with more loot. And guys, I'm actually going low on those CWO medals. So you might be saying, what am I going to do after that? Ah, it's going to be kind of crazy, guys. Okay, keep keep watching. Keep watching. I'm a bit scared, but the supercharge on these defenses, I don't think I'm going to do. It's just going to be useless. It's too much. It's too much for me. All right. But the heroes. So one thing we can do is to start for the Barbarian King. We can get him to level 100. We can get the Queen to level 100 and just see what we can do with our rest of the heroes. We are looking at a decent amount of Rune of Dark, but not too much like maybe other creators. A lot of people have been stacking from a way back time, but we're going to upgrade the King to level 97, another upgrade and get the book for that. We are going to have more upgrades on our King. We do have 900,000 Dark Elixir left, so we could go to level 100, but wait, oh, why did I just do that? <laughs> now, man, this hero hall building, it looks so clean, right? It looks amazing. Now, we do have upgrades for the queen, which we can easily do because we do have the runes. So let's keep on booking them. I have no issues with the book. It's just about the dark, man. That's why you can see I got 40,000 gems just for those. I'm going to keep them. But one thing is here is that we cannot reach a decent amount. So I needed to buy a dark elixir rune from the store because, yeah, the dark elixir is too expensive with the gems. So I'll come back after I bought it. All right, so what I'm going to do actually is to gem the queen right now and then use a rune. Just whatever, man. It's crazy. 98, we can use another rune to get the queen to level 99. I don't have a hammer. I'm not going to buy a hammer just because we can use those um, kind of CW medals a lot better. But 84,000 Dark Elixir, we cannot do anything with it. So unfortunately, it's going to go to trash. Sorry, but 82,000 was just not enough. But getting the queen to level 100 is a beautiful feeling because we got two double, triple digit heroes. So we can have two more of those runes and then one is inside the shop. So what I'm going to do is to buy more, but we got the RC. So let's go ahead and upgrade her. We need a lot of gems, guys, on these Dark Elixir stuff. I wish I had more Dark Elixir runes. That's just my only wish. Just because on my other account, I do have a lot of Dark Elixir runes, but I don't have a lot of other stuff. So it's just different, you know? Like, I'm like, oh, I wish I could transfer everything on one of my accounts. But it's just unfortunate. It is what it is. We just have to gem her probably most likely because I cannot do anything else unless buying one more offer with those resources and buying one more rune of dark so we got the offer oof guys this is looking crazy yeah i invested a lot of money into this you know gemming spree but it is what it is man as i said anything for you guys and anything to help me also grow from your support as always you've been giving me for the past year it's been absolutely crazy and this is where i am right now because of you guys so thank you again very much and hopefully i'm able to give you enough info and details and every update and the sneak peek and all those stuff related to Clash of Clans. But we have work to do. This is going to be where I'm going to go slightly crazy. We do have a lot of, you know, you know books left, but we're not going to have that much upgrades of the heroes left. So RC, yeah, you saw the gems, right? 
So what I'm thinking I'm going to do is to gem her at the last level because 3,400, 300,000 is kind of crazy. But one thing I forgot was the abilities. So let's go and max everything on these abilities because obviously my other abilities are maxed except that little king kind of uh, vamp stash but i don't really care about that i'm not gonna invest these ores into that but i've been keeping ores for epic equipments which is really good so now going into the dark over ability let's get it upgraded to level 18 it looks kind of crazy when you see it from the you know just perspective wise but i don't know how it's gonna work in the attack so don't worry i'm gonna do a lot of videos and i already planned nine videos for you guys to bring but you can see everything is max now except the vamp stash but whatever man get the hell out of my face everything is maxed i'm fine with these abilities we can move on and just let's see the price of these bombs and traps man because 9 million is crazy for a giant bomb. Thank you, Supercell, for this pricing. Yeah, okay? Like, chill out. <laughs> Holy hell. We're buying all those medals at the end. And we're going to jump the giant bomb. And this is where we're going to get a bit dirty. Because the rest of the giant bombs, there is no way I can put that much more gold. I'm done. I'm done with the gold. We're finished. Let's go ahead and gem this. We're going to gem the giant bombs because they do more damage than the regular bombs, of course. Everything else is decent, but yeah. It's like, ah, uh, what can we do, man? You know, it's just like, yeah, traps. It's like, they give a lot of traps in this update. They give a lot of traps. And that's what they usually don't do. And we have five hero upgrades and supercharges on top of them with equipments. This update may just be the biggest update Clash of Clans has ever released, as in content-wise. There is a lot to do and hopefully I was able to give you enough in this gemming spree because I know I didn't get to the fully maxed stuff because yeah, I got like 10k gems left. There's no way we can get to the fully maxed. It's just not possible. But hopefully you guys again enjoyed this and enjoyed this gemming spree. I'm going to be upgrading the rest of the traps easily with loot and dropping those builder potions right on top of them. But we do have the new troops, the thrower, which I have two strategies coming with this troop. Stay tuned because I'm going to go crazy with this beautiful troop, but we're going to have to gem it. We just have to go to gem it. It's just not possible to do anything else. Now we do have some books in those um what do you call this like the gold pass which i will come back to that so opening the gold pass let's see we got a book of building we got a book of heroes which i'm not gonna use we got dark we got another book of heroes we got a dark rune which is good and we do have a book of spells we got more gold and elixir let's collect this oh we can actually upgrade some walls so no worries there and elixir and gold nice these are the ones that i got now guys i did edit the video slightly so i'm live again because my mic was going kind of crazy you know what i'm saying so more wall rings we can collect them later we can collect the book of fighting and we should be sweet so one thing i'm gonna do now is where where's my rc it's level 49 okay we can get that maximum let's go with that rune let's get the rc to the maximum level good thing i kind of realized and remembered that we do have the gold pass because yeah yeah obviously doing this gemming spree usually i forget you know what i'm saying but still we can go to the laboratory we can get this troop to the maximum level and book that obviously these spells I'm not really going to invest that much on it. It is what it is. We're just going to leave it. But with the super troops are where we can go crazy. So what do we have with the gold? Oh, we got the giant bomb, the giga bomb. Wait, no, I didn't even build this. Hold on a second. Okay, this is where we can go with our loot. Let's go like this. We can, um, yeah, we're going to use the gems on this one. And then we can upgrade this, use another gem, use another gem, and then the maximum level, level 3. So, one thing I'm going to do is, I forgot about these traps, guys. Honestly, I forgot about the traps. I'm cooked, I know. I'm kind of cooked, not even going to lie. But wait, can we collect this? I need a bit more gold. Oh, guys, I'm going broke. I'm going too broke, man. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and the gemming spree. Obviously, I could not get to maximum level. There is a lot going on in this update, as I just explained. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this and come back because I got nine videos planned for you guys with strategies, air strategies, ground strategies, methods of using the new hero, abilities, equipments, everything I got planned for you and a new Town Hall 17 base I'm dropping very soon. So stay tuned for that. And hopefully you guys like this. Drop a like and subscribe for more. See you soon. Take care and peace.